You've likely heard about the total solar eclipse that will happen on Monday, April 8, 2024, at the Moon's ascending node. Of course, thanks to technology, we now live in a period when information can be quickly accessed through the Internet. However, in ancient times, before modern conveniences, many believed that an eclipse meant that God was furious and interpreted it as a negative omen. In this video, we will see the records of various civilizations and their thoughts when they witnessed the solar eclipse for the very first time. The oldest eclipse in recorded human history, which could have happened in November of 3340 BCE, is where our journey begins. The proof is derived from a collection of circular and spiral petroglyphs found at the Loughcrew Megalithic Monument in County Meath, Ireland. More than 50 burned remains with images of overlapping and concentric rings have been found by archaeologists, which provides us with actual information on the solar eclipse that was observed by people at that time. The Chinese began observing eclipses on the oracle bones, tortoise shells, and shoulder blades of oxen around 1200 BCE. The scribes wrote, the sun has been eaten in these eclipse records. These records, which date back more than 4,000 years, include in-depth analyses and observations of solar eclipses. They would beat drums and create loud noises in an attempt to frighten away what they thought was a dragon or other mythical beast that was consuming the sun. In prehistoric Mesopotamia, the Babylonians documented astronomical occurrences, such as eclipses, and frequently read them as signs or messages from the gods. Eclipses were seen by them as prophetic signs of impending doom for kings and other powerful people. Solar eclipses are also mentioned in the chronicles of the ancient Egyptians, who considered them to be celestial occurrences. Eclipses were once thought to be a fight between the gods Horus, who stood for the sun, and Seth, who stood for the dark, with the result determining what happened on Earth. The next known instance of a solar eclipse is from ancient Greece. Around 585 BCE, Greek philosophers like Thales of Miletus tried to forecast solar eclipses using mathematical principles as opposed to paranormal theories. Eclipses were nevertheless seen as prophetic occurrences that could affect political choices. The ancient Mayans developed the science of astronomy, calendar systems, and hieroglyphic writing. These comprehensive records of the solar eclipse were kept by the Mayan people, who wrote them in books made of accordion-folded bark called caudices, painted on ceramics and murals, and cut hieroglyphs into stone. These astronomical events terrified and confused humanity, regardless of their era or civilization. However, our curiosity drove us to seek an explanation for why it occurs, and when we did, we discovered that there are no terrible omens. Rather, it is a stunning natural occurrence that has happened before and will continue to occur after we are gone.